working in Okay, let me check. Is anybody there? Good evening. Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you? Pretty good. Looking for another background. <laughs> Wait a second. Okay. What about you? Sorry? What about you? Uh, I'm finished my, my dinner right now. <laughs> hey, bon appetit. Thank you. Okay, I think this one will work. Wait a sec. Okay, yeah, this one looks better. Hey, Blanca, Jackie, uh, Mariela. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Yeah, it looks better now. Okay, so do you have a good day today? We are in the middle of the week. I miss vacations. <laughs> so you need you need more vacations. Yeah, I need more more vacations. To recover from your previous vacations, right? Sorry, I don't hear the last thing. That you to, say. to recover from your previous vacation. Yeah, I'm in more vacation because I have to recover. <laughs> okay, okay, perfect. So now I see you, Fabio, and Elizabeth is connected now. Good evening. Good evening. How is it going? Today, fine. <laughs> okay. Okay, I think that your classmates are coming soon. Remember that today we have work to do and uh, especially, especially about the SWOT analysis. Hello, good evening. I see Anari now. These are not my favorite headphones, but I had to use them because I found a little uh, lamp to connect to my computer. So I had to sacrifice one of the, of the USB ports. I don't know, but nowadays, nowadays computers have less things than the previous ones in terms of uh, ports, because now they only have HDMI, so they don't have v, uh, VGA. Uh, they used to have, uh, more USB ports, now they have just one or two maximum. So it seems a little bit more complex to you. Yes, even mine have three, only three USB ports. Mm -hmm. Before I see some old laptops or computers, they have woof, a lot. A lot. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So you have to in the back. <laughs> you have to buy more adapters, more gadgets. 
Yes, and I see it, I see even in the office laptops mm -hmm. uh, that some of the some of them some of the new ones even didn't have a LAN port. Wow. So yes, and that's a bit <laughs> awful. <laughs> Okay, Diana, Flor, and Suleyma, welcome. Thank you, good evening. Good evening. Seems like Flor is ready to work at a call center. <laughs> Okay, Suleim is still working, but she's with us now. So I'm going to get started, guys. Uh, first of all, I want to check how much you remember from yesterday's class. Uh, what did we do yesterday? Can you remind me a little bit about that? Yes, we were talking about adverb clauses of time other classes of time okay yes correct what else we also talk about the SWOT analysis correct and Anything else? Well, only remember, well, not only remember, but the, the topic that Diana says, um, the reduce the adverse, adverse, oh my God, I forgot <laughs> the, the name. Uh, adverse clauses, yeah. Nice. And anything else? The meaning of the spot, strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. The definitions. Yeah, the definitions, exactly. And do we have any opportunity to discuss uh, or to work together with your with other people? Do you remember if there was an opportunity to practice with other people, practice English with other people? Just the homework that we had in vacations. Okay. And yeah, the conversation uh, as well, right? Remember that. Uh, and the topic that we discussed a lot was the uh, advert classes of time, okay? And how we can reduce them, right? How we can reduce them. So today is the end of the unit number one. So we are finishing the week number one too. So that's a great, a great achievement, okay? So one week off. So good for you okay good for you and time flies okay time flies so you have to keep that in mind okay uh, at the beginning it sounds like okay so we have five weeks for this module yes and then we are saying goodbye right and uh, and little by little you're getting to the advanced level so that's that's going to be awesome Actually, this topic of adverbial clauses is a little bit advanced to tell you the truth, but we didn't make this manual, right? So uh, we didn't choose the topics. 
I'm going to start by taking the attendance, guys. Then we're going to have a little uh, conversation. So we're going to get to know a little bit more about each other. And then we're going to start working in groups, okay? Doing the SWOT analysis of a product that you are going to propose to your group, right? So um, today is the review and practice, okay, day. So we're going to check that everything that we have talked about, everything that we have studied in unit one is clear and everyone understands and has no doubts, okay, about that, about every single topic. And well, let's get started, Beatriz. Not here yet, but probably she will be here soon. Uh, Mariela? I am here. Blanca? I'm here. Okay, now I see more people with the, with the cameras on. Freddy's, welcome. Hey, Laura, you're back. I was thinking about, about you. I wasn't sure if you were okay or not, but I was looking for your phone number and I, I didn't find it. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, I, I, I lost the two last days because I have so much job. Ah, just, you had a lot of work to do. Yes. Oh, just, okay. Just now I, I, como se dice, out of my work and I'm driving now. Wow. Be careful, please. <laughs> Drive safely. Yes. Thank I know you. that driving in San Salvador is a big challenge. Yes. Okay? <laughs> Especially during the rush hour, right, or at night. And so, let's <laughs> yes. see. Thank okay, you. So, good to see you. And Harbin is ready too. Now we're going to go on. I already mentioned Beatriz, so we'll continue with uh, Mariela, Blanca, uh, Brenda. It's not here yet. So we we'll continue with Diana. Hello. Good evening. <laughs> good evening. And we'll continue with the next one that is Floor. I'm here, teacher. Francisco. Okay, not here yet, but surely it will he be. He sent here. a message in the WhatsApp group. Really? Oh, yeah. Okay, I didn't see it. What did he say? Uh, I have problems with the internet, but I will try to connect with my cell phone. However, the signal is very low. The signal is very low. Okay, I got it now. I used to get confused with those two words, signal and sign, because they are very similar. Uh -huh. It's signal. Signal, yeah, and the other one it's is sign. Form. Mm -hmm. okay, sign. Thank you. Sign and signal. It's like um, I used to get confused at the beginning with uh, evil and devil. Like, I didn't know if it was... Uh, it's evil and thing. evil. I mean, the pronunciation, I, did, I didn't uh, know. Uh, but the thing is the same, right? Uh, no, there are different things. But they're related. They are related. Uh -huh. uh, Gustavo, you have a question and comments? Uh, yes, I'm here, but I am finished my dinner after I turn on my, my camera. Okay, okay. Thank you for letting me know. So, bon appetit. And we continue with Freddy. Thank you. Hi. Good evening. Hey, good evening. Uh, okay, so Laura was driving. We continue with Jackie. Have you seen Jackie? Present. Oh, there you are. <laughs> okay, Harvin. Can you hear me well? Or yes, do, teacher. Or do you hear any interference in my voice or? So surprisingly, okay. the internet is good today. Um, Jennifer, not here yet. Juan Jose. I'm here. Thank you. Gustavo is eating. Uh, we continue with Miguel. Yeah, I'm here. Miguel Angel. Nope. Fabio. I'm here. Rolando. Yanari. I'm here, teacher. 
Irma. Not here. Anna Elizabeth. I'm here. And Suleyma, Elizabeth. I'm here. Okay, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to go on. So I'm going to share through the chat, okay, the link that you're going to use for the conversation. So you are going to be uh, sharing opinions. You have a lot of things to talk about in this in this topic. And it's tell me about, okay, tell me about. So there are many topics. You choose the ones that you like, right? Um, and then just uh, express an opinion, right? So try to give complete answers. Okay, uh, Francisco is connecting now, so that's good. And here is a, the link for you to open it and discuss in the breakout rooms. You are going to be uh, in small rooms. Okay, right now we have, let me check how many participants. Seven, okay. So, okay, one, two, one, two, and three, one, two, and three, very good. So I'm just going to make some modifications here. And yeah, just one change here. Okay, I think that we're ready. And you will have exactly six minutes, okay, to practice speaking as much as you can, right? So please go question, answer, question, answer, answer, question, and on, until everybody has spoken, right? Uh, in the in the breakout room. Uh, Francisco, you raise your hand. Uh, yes, good evening, teacher. Sorry, good evening. Uh, what do you do? Right now, you are going to open the link that is in the chat and you're going to have a conversation with your partner. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, okay. perfect. So here we go. Accept the invitation, please. And I will see you in a moment. I think as many of us that I'm not good, but I try to be here. Ah, gotcha. Yeah. Why the nervous face, Flor? No, we are we are doing leading. Okay, okay. But now we, we, we went to start. Okay. Um, Mariela, can you tell me about something? Like someone I dislike. Hmm. It can be. It can be someone famous, like uh, you can say, uh, I don't like Bad Bunny. And then you express uh, okay. it. <laughs> and then you, you, why? Can, you can say, why? why? Uh, <laughs> that's a personal opinion, right? <laughs> uh, okay. it, it's not it. true. It's not true. It's true for me, but I'm not sure if it's uh, true for Freddie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> a person that I dislike. Let me see. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I agree with the teacher. 
Israeli that uh, someone hates <laughs> <laughs> Bugs Bunny. <laughs> be careful. Be careful, Laura, be careful. Yes, of course. <laughs> yes. I think it was, it was too, too simple, but, but I love it. Uh, uh, they they talk about uh, this man. Uh, 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 no, no, no. For me, it's just not like nothing, nothing. Yes, yes. Uh, me too. Is is very very bad this kind of music. I know you understand okay. because they like the the Herreo? style of of, of song. Yes, reggaeton music. Uh, the new, the new reggaeton, yeah, I, I know. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's not, it's not like the classic reggaeton, right? Yes. Yeah, we, no. We oh, about, no. This, this man, uh, Maluma. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I know. Yes. I, I don't know. You understand because my coworkers like this kind of music. It's very, very bad. <laughs> but... <laughs> Okay. It is what it is. Okay. Sorry? It is what it is. What? That's expression. It is what it is. Like, well, we yeah, cannot change it, it is right? What it is. Yes, it is yes, what it yes, is. exactly. Yeah. It is what it is. Yeah. What it is what it is. Okay. It is, it is like to, to the colors of the world, I was it. What? What? En español hay un dicho que dice para los gustos los colores y es different. Uh, yeah, yeah, kind exactly. of, kind of, yeah. Oh, okay. Ni modo. Yeah. <laughs> it is what it is. Uh -huh. <laughs> it okay. is what it is. Yeah. Okay, Francisco, okay. can you tell me about something you really care about? Um. Yes, for example, um, my family is very important for me, my mother, my wife, my daughter, my, my brothers. Uh, when I have the opportunity to uh, they, they have a meeting with my brother, uh, we have a, a good moment. Because uh, I don't, I don't know, can't, or how do you say it? No los puedo ver muy menudo, a menudo? I can't see them I can often. See. I can't see? I can't see them often. I can't um, see them often. I can't see them the often. See them often. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm -hmm. uh, yeah, for me, for me, it's almost the same thing. Uh, I have. I appreciate my family, and for me, is the 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 first uh, in the line for protect or really really care about them. Uh, so, yeah, almost the same. Uh, and second one maybe is is the my job. I like my my job. Uh, okay. I like or oh, uh, yeah, I like uh, what I do. Mm -hmm. So this is important for me, and, and this is the, the the kind of priorities for for my life. Okay. Uh, where do you work, uh, Gustavo? What? Where do you work? Uh, this the the company is called um, Telesis. It's a communications company. Ah, okay. The provide uh, service with uh, internet, no? No, radio, by radio. Ah, okay. We, okay. Uh, we work a lot. Uh, we we work a lot with the uh, with the police, also with the airport, uh, with the many uh, how called the ministerios, ministries, ministries, yeah, ministries of the government we we provide the, this this kind of service oh, okay. also we have um provide a uh, machines of x-ray 
for the mm. airport. Uh, mm. All this week, I, I, I was working there in the airport because I, right now, I need to um, give a capacitations for for almost 100 people for use this, this kind of machines. Oh, okay. so a little bit busy this, this week. Yes. It's, it's interesting you work. Yeah, I passed a little bit busy, very, <laughs> very, uh, almost all the day. Yes. Okay, can you tell about someone you dislike? Ah, uh, yes. Mm. For example, I have a neighbor that is a, a little complicated. Complicado. Complicated. Complicated, yes. Um, maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh -huh. tell me, tell me, sorry. Uh, uh, for example, they do not like that the uh, when I go in, in for example, in, in, in my car, this uh, he is a uh, his or uh, Yes, he is a little angry because they say that uh, this part of the, the the highway or calle street street is 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 the property than him. However, <laughs> it's the public really wow. yes, but with all person that with what with, with, with all neighbors is is mm. the same problem on only uh, with this this person uh for me okay we need to leave out you have, have 30, 30 seconds 30 <laughs> seconds okay for me uh, maybe almost uh, the traffic for me i dislike the traffic uh, I, I dislike the, the tradition for the people here house driving they they don't have a how how's the name for costumbres customs tradition customs yes yeah customs it's, it's, it's complicated for me because I was working uh, in the past uh, out of El Salvador and, and and I learned the the customs of the other countries uh, give the pass uh, uh turn on the light etc. So it's, for me here is is a little bit complicated this thing. Yeah. Okay, we go now to the. Yeah, we go back room. to the room. All right. So the time is up. Now, um, I know that it was not enough time, and there were a lot of topics, and some of the topics were probably um, longer, well, more complex, or you have more things to say about them. So therefore it's not really easy to do it. However, the point is that you have the opportunity to practice. And at the same time, you realize that there are so many things in English that you can talk about. Um, so if you are running out of ideas, you can use that, that website, right? So you have hundreds of topics, thousands of questions, so uh, there are no excuses, right? There are no excuses for not speaking English. Now, I'm going to uh, go on. And uh, as I told you yesterday, uh, we are going to be working in teams, OK? What is the difference between a team and a group? There's a little difference. I think a team is when you to work together and make the things happen, I think. And group, it's just, uh, I don't know, person reunited, I think, <laughs> that doesn't help each other, I think. Okay. So 
you are very close, very close, especially in definition of team, right? So team and group are, yeah, it's a group of people, but a team is, uh, I mean, everybody's doing their job so uh, they can achieve uh, the same objective, right? That's a team. But a group of people can be working individually with their own objectives without worrying or caring about the rest. So uh, at the bus stop, right, there's a group of people. They are not working together. Or they are not going in the same direction, right? They are just together. Uh, but a team, as you know, in a soccer team or a baseball team or whatever kind of team, they are trying to play together or do things together so they can be be successful, right, in their in their goals. So um, that's the difference. So we're going to work as a team, okay? Thinking about the SWOT analysis and the products. So, uh, but before that, before that, I was uh, trying to. Okay, well, hold on. It's not common that my, that my dog barks, but when he does it, it's because there are some other dogs on the street. So um, here I'm going to share it with you. So something that we did yesterday and that was a little bit uh, challenging, right, was to complete the exercise for uh, the verbal clauses and the reduction. So for that reason, I, I want to share with you some sentences or a little exercise to go deeper into that or to give you more uh, practice and the opportunity to understand this better, okay? So first of all, uh, there's one example that's number one. Uh, it's not necessarily a one that can be reduced, but it's one example that shows you the two elements of an adverb class, okay? That is basically having two statements where one is independent and the other one is dependent. So dependent clause is usually the one that has the adverb, right? Or the, the, time, uh, the time proposition or the proposition of time in this case, we have been studying before, after, while, since. Those are the ones that we have been studying. Uh, of course, there are more, but these are the ones that we focus on. So I always take a bath space, I go to bed. What would be the correct preposition of time here? Before. I always take a bath before I before. go to bed. Okay, so that's the logical order, right? It's not after I go to bed uh, or while I go to bed. Um, correct. So in this case, which one is the adverb class? I always take a bath or before I go to bed? Before I go to bed. Before I go to bed, excellent. So where you see the, the, the in this case, we're talking about time clauses, right? So where, wherever you see the preposition of time or any kind of preposition uh, that can be for uh, purposes, it can be for conditions, etc., etc., etc. But right now we just focus on time. So where you see that it's right before the sentence, that is the clause, the advert clause. And what is the name of the second clause? In this case, I always take a bath. Remember that we can change the position with no problem. The meaning is the same. The other one can have two possible names. Okay. That are the most common ones. If you saw the video, or if you remember from yesterday, you will say in the independent class. Okay, the independent class. I always take a bath. It makes sense by itself. Another form to call this is main class. That is the most important class, okay? The main class. So um, is it possible to say, before I go to bed, I always take a bath? Yes? What is going yeah, to be- it's possible. What is going to be different if I change the position? 
the meaning is the same. The meaning is the same. Uh, the it words are somehow. the same. So the only thing is about punctuation. So if we say the sentence in the other way, in the other direction, or in the other order, I will say before I go to bed, comma. So we don't have a connector, so we need to use a comma. Before I go to bed, I always take a bath. Okay, so in El Salvador, we normally take a shower, right? Not a bath. So uh, that's just for you to identify that the adverb clause has two clauses. One is the adverb clause, the other one is the, uh, or one is the dependent clause and the other one is independent. And um, the order, right? If the preposition of time is in the middle, you don't need a comma. If it is at the beginning, you need a comma. Um, and that's it. Now, let's go with number two, three, and four, okay? So we're going to do this together. Uh, number two uh, will be for girls. Number three will be for boys. And number four will be for everybody. So we're going to answer them together. So girls, what do you think is the complement for number two? While I work as a content, I learned a lot about mana management. About management. 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 Um, while. Okay, that's correct. Uh, is it possible to make a reduction here? Yes or no? Is it possible to make a reduction? Think yes. Yes. So we can use an adverbial phrase. What are we going to do to make the reduction? While working, working as a accountant. Okay, that is the answer. As an accountant. I learned, I learned a lot about management. I learned a lot and then we go with the complex. Okay, so what is the, the rule? There are two basic rules. If it's possible to make a reduction, well, we say three rules. First of all, you, how, what is what you have to see to make sure that it's possible to make a reduction? We have the same subject. Okay, so you need to identify if the sentence has the same subject in the two classes, correct? So that's the first thing, okay? Then if you say, yeah, the two, the two subjects are the same, you make the reduction. So you have to uh, follow two rules. Rule number one, Eliminate what? Eliminate the subject in the adverb. In the adverb clause. Plus. Okay, correct. And the second rule? Add ing at the verb. Add ing to the verb. Now, the gentlemen, verb. gentlemen, what happens if the verb, if the clause has any form of the verb be? Am, is, are, was, were. We eliminate it. We eliminate it. You eliminate that, right? Correct. So uh, this is correct. So class for the ladies, please. Gentlemen, you can use the reactions. And here they are. I'm going to use a little heart. Very good, thank you so much, uh, girls. We continue with number three. Boys, what do you think about this one? What is the correct answer here? Before? Since? Before, since, while? Before. 
read the complete sentence. Okay, that's one of the first things that I tell my students when they are completing an exercise or a test. Read the complete sentence. First, read the indication. And then the way they do marketing sense, they adapted to a new trend, a new generation. Generation. Is it? So we have two people saying that it's since and somebody saying before. So the majority said since. And yes, that is correct. So uh, in this case, since is a correct answer. Now, is it possible to make a reduction here? Yes or no? I think that no, because I don't know how the same subject. They don't have the same subject. For me, it's possible because companies could be they. Hmm. Or not. That's a good point. So somebody else who has another opinion or a similar opinion to support, uh, in this case, Rolando? They adapted to the new. I agree okay. with Rolando. Yes, I agree with him. It is possible. Okay, so since, well, companies and they. <laughs> Teacher. So if, if you say that it's possible to reduce, oh, floor, sorry. Well, in my opinion, I think that the subject is the same, but if you separate the sentence, for me, it doesn't make sense, for my opinion. So you can reduce, reduce. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is something really important. What Flor mentioned is true, okay? It is possible to make a reduction according to the rule. Like you can say companies have changed the way they do marketing since adapting to the new trends, new trends and new generations. Uh, however, it's, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense, right? Since adapting to the new trends and new generations, what? I mean, it's missing something else if you eliminate the subject, right? Uh, so in this case, it is possible according to the rule to, uh, to make a reduction, but in terms of meaning, it wouldn't make sense if you reduce it, okay? So this is an exception to the rule, okay? Because the meaning is important. So thank you so much, gentlemen, you are right, okay? It is possible to make a reduction. The correct answer is since, but in this case, we don't do it because the meaning, it's strength. I mean, there's no clear meaning if we just cut it and we reduce it like that. So the last one is for everybody. Space. No points for voice. The supervisor. <laughs> no, no competition today. <laughs> the supervisor conducts a SWOT analysis. She sends an email to all the employees so they are aware about it in advance. So. What do you think is the, is the correct answer? After, before, while, or before? Before. Before, Obviously. before the supervisor conducts a SWOT analysis, she sends an email to all the employees so they are aware about, about it in advance. About it in advance. Okay, about it in advance. That's correct. So, yes, the correct answer is before. Now, is it? possible to make a reduction here? That's a $1 million question. Ten, 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 ten. I think yes. 
in my game teacher, I, I think the no is possible. For because me, yes. Be, <laughs> sorry, Miguel, sorry, sorry. Because the subject is different. I think the supervisor is, is for he. And remember that in English, in English, there is no gender in, uh, in a lot of words. When you say teacher, it can be male or female. When you say principal, it can be male or female. When you say president, it can be male or female. Somebody, please turn off the microphone so we can, so we don't, we do not hear what's going on there. Okay, so um, done. Uh, so in this case, supervisor can be a woman or can be a man. Remember that in English, the majority of the words don't have a gender. Okay, they are neutral. They can be used for both. Mm -hmm. In Spanish, that we have, we complicate our lives because we're trying to do everything. Okay, male yeah, but version and female version. If you change, uh, who sent the mail? You lost who sent the mail. So for that reason, I, I think it's not possible to change it. But I have a there, right there is there is one solution here. I made these sentences. I invented these sentences on purpose. Okay. Because I want to show you, I have, I want to show you how complex, how complex or, or how tricky the language can be. Okay, so in this case, uh, it is possible to make a reduction. Floor, you have an idea about what the answer can be? Yes, be? maybe before before conducting a SWOT analysis, the supervisor sent a, an email to all the employees so they are aware about, about it in advance. Okay, one little star for floor. Okay, hooray. I, I want a tara. A tara, okay, I will give you one tara. So in this case, that is the answer, guys. It is possible to make a reduction, but as the if you eliminate the, the supervisor, it's not clear who you're talking about when you say she, because there is not a previous reference, you need to mention supervisor instead of saying she. Okay, so that is a modification and it is possible to make a, a, a reduction. So you say before conducting a SWOT analysis, comma, the supervisor sends an email to all the employees so they are aware about it in advance. So congratulations, okay, you got it. And yes, I mean, uh, the language is flexible, it's adaptable. So we, we need to learn how to use it, right? Uh, this is like playing with Lego or uh, solving a puzzle or playing with uh, Play-Doh, right? Plastilina. So you are, adapting it, right? You are making the language yours so you can change some things to make it work. So, um, correct. So is that clear now? We have three different scenarios here. The number one, it was easy, right? It was not that difficult. Uh, number two was possible, but it doesn't make a lot of sense, okay? Uh, and the last one, it's possible to make a reduction. However, it's not clear if you don't change the pronoun she. So you need to use the supervisor instead of she, okay? But it is possible. So this is, a, sorry, a little exercise that I wanted to, to do with you guys so that you continue understanding or getting the, the idea how to use these classes. Of course, you, the majority of you, I know that you are not thinking about becoming English teachers, uh, but, but the more you know uh, how the, the more you understand how the language is structured, the, the easier it's going to be for you to communicate, okay? Because you're going to start creating your own sentences based on the information that you already know, okay? And remember, one of my favorite quotes is, Practice makes perfect. That's one of my motto, I would say. 
motto in uh do you know what motto is m-o-t-t-o -T -T it's your way of operate 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 i think operating operating yeah my philosophy right like my motto uh, is practice makes perfect of course we're not going to we're not intending to be perfect because nobody's perfect. But as in Spanish, we say, la practica es el maestro, right? So it's something similar. Practice makes perfect. Okay, now, um, in my opinion, practice makes better, right? So uh, you improve when you, the, more, the more you practice. Okay, so guys, it's the time for you to start working, okay? In teams. So what are you going to do? Easy. Uh, I need a volunteer to help me read the indications for this exercise. Raise your hand, please. Blanca. I clap. <laughs> yeah. <Sorry. laughs> okay. Work, no, group, group work, decide on a new product service your company might launch to the market brainstorm useful question to get information related to each of the stage on the SWOT analysis stages, stages. stages. Uh -huh. sorry no, run the sorry. SWOT analysis yes i always say sorry <laughs> yeah it's a custom i know yeah it's a habit uh, Bates on the results of the SWOT analysis, discuss whether the idea for the new product service has, sorry, I can't say product and service together, but product service. <laughs> new product has, or service. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Has potential to move to the next step in the product development cycle. There you okay. go. Awesome. Thank you. So that's what you're going to do, guys. Um, it seems a little complex, but I think that for this exercise, you can take as a reference the image that Freddy sent to the WhatsApp group yesterday, because there are some specific uh, characteristics that you can consider for each of the four elements of the SWOT, right? So, um, even if you don't have a name of a company, even if you don't agree on what kind of company you have, you need to agree on one product or service that you are going to offer, okay? Why? Because after the time that you're going to work together, you are going to make a presentation to the class, okay? You are one or two people from the group are going to have uh, some minutes, a couple of minutes uh, to tell the group okay, to tell the class, sorry, about the product and the characteristics, right? The strength of the product, the weaknesses of the product, the opportunities that you have with that product and the threats that you have in, the, in your company with that product. So um, for instance, okay, I'm going to make this up right now so that you can see that what I want, or what, I, what I need you to do, right? So I'm going to think about a company and something that is trending right now is, um, let me check, delivery. Okay, delivery service is something that, I mean, there are like a million delivery service now in El Salvador, right? Um, so my product, is going to be in that field. It's going to be a delivery service, but my product is different. Okay, so I need to think about the characteristics, right? Uh, what, is, what is going to be the difference for, from my product to the rest of the deliveries? Okay, so one of the differences and the strength that my product has is that uh, this delivery is going to be, first of all, uh, for free, to the customer, to the customer. So the company that I make the alliance with is going to give me a percentage, okay, for the delivery. Um, what is going to be the benefit for the company? 
I am going to be promoting their product in my social networks, in the social network of my company. I don't have the name. I'm going to, uh, okay, I have the name now. The name of my delivery service is Ready Freddy. Um, so uh, I am going to offer that benefit to the company. So I promote their product, their company with the customers. That's, those are my two strengths. So people like it because they don't pay for the delivery and the companies like it because I help them with the promotion and the marketing. So everybody wins. Uh, weaknesses. Well, I would say that one of my weaknesses is that uh, not all the companies, not all the companies accept or could accept that deal, okay, of giving me money for the delivery. Uh, because probably they have their own ideas or they can have their own delivery. Uh, another weakness uh, might be that I'm a new, I'm a new uh, service, I'm a new provider uh, in the market. And there are others that have been since the pandemic or before the pandemic. Opportunities, the opportunities that I have to grow is that uh, as I use, I am using social networks for my product and for the companies that I work with, uh, I have the chance to get sponsors that could give me some money, right? Probably sponsors from other countries. They can join me and, they, and we can buy more and more cycles and we can offer, we can buy cars so that we can uh, send more products abroad right? I mean, not abroad, but probably across the country. So it could grow more. And with that opportunity of growing and making businesses with new sponsors or getting sponsors, I think that I am going to be stronger than the majority of my competitors because uh, they just usually work locally, right? In one department or in one city. Um, and then threats. Uh, I would say the new uh, delivery services like uh, that are, I mean, really strong right now. Uh, they are using a lot of marketing, a lot of uh, resources uh, like Pedidos Ya or Hugo. I feel they are very strong and their marketing strategies are really good. So it's going to be a little bit difficult to compete with them. And they have some ideas that I, that I had, like creating an app or having uh, some attractive attractive uh, offers or deals for the customers. So um, I think that that would be a threat for, or th those would be some threat, some threats for my, my company. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do, okay? In this moment, supposedly I worked with my team, right? With this, with this idea and I present it to the class. So, of course, your idea is going to be better because you're going to have three or, or four brilliant minds working on one product or one service uh, with all the characteristics of the SWOT analysis, okay? Uh, do you have any doubts? Is the example that I gave you clear enough or you would like me to explain you a little bit more before you go and work with your team? Yes, no. I think it's clear. Did I make myself clear? Yes. Blanca says yes. Use a like reaction. Clear like horchata. Oh my God. I wish you had said clear like coffee. That would be better. So, uh, okay, guys. So, if you don't have any doubts, I'm going to take the tennis before you go to the breakout rooms. Okay, let's see. Uh, Suleyma and Anna, are you there? I'm here. Okay. Uh, well, Roxana told me that she's not feeling well, uh, so she couldn't handle it and she couldn't connect. Uh, Yanari? Rolando? Hello. Hello. Fabio? I'm here. Miguel Angel. Uh, Luis. Gustavo. Yes, I'm here. Okay, Juan Jose. Jennifer. I'm here. 
Okay, thank you, Mr. Jennifer. Harvin. Present teacher. Jackie. Present. Okay, then we'll continue with uh, Laura. Present teacher. Oh, Miguel is here. Nice. Yeah. Okay, here, teacher. Perfect. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, that's okay. Freddy. Francisco. Present teacher. Okay, good. Uh, Flor. I'm here. Diana. I'm here. Blanca. I'm here. Mariela. I'm here. And Beatriz. I'm here. Okay, that's my crew. That's my people. So, uh, hold on. I'm going to create a breakout room so you have more people working with you and you have more ideas, of course. So, I'm going to create just five. Mm, yeah. Five times four, that would be 20. Four times four, that would be 16. So I want to create four groups. One, two, three. Hey, Brenda, are you there? I think she's connected right now. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four. So I'm just going to make a little modification here. Wait a second. Hmm. Okay, and one more modification. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we're good. So everybody is going to be working in groups of four. And just let me move one more person to the room number two. Okay, perfect. So how much time are you going to have for this? As it's going to be something very complete, very uh, complex, let's say, you will need more time. So the indications are very simple, okay? One person in the group, please, you be the note taker. So you take notes on a paper, on paper or on a computer, right, on a document. One person in the group is going to be taking notes about the analysis, right? The characteristics, the name of the product, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, another person in the group has to present. One or two people have to present the product when we come back to, from the breakout rooms. So you have to choose or the, they offer as, I mean, the volunteer. Uh, to do it, one person minimum, maximum two people. And uh, what else? Uh, somebody, ah, the other person, please take, take time, take the time, okay? So you are in charge of controlling, monitoring, the time is enough. Hey, we have two minutes, let's hurry up, right? So one person is controlling that everybody's participating and taking the control of time, okay? So everybody has a role in the group. And of course, everybody in the group has to speak, give an opinion, okay? So um, don't worry if you don't have a name for the company, if you are not very clear about what the company is doing, but you have to be sure about the product, okay? And make the analysis, the SWOT analysis for that product. Um, so the time that you have for this is 15 minutes, okay? So it's more than enough. If I see that the majority of the groups or all the groups finish before the 15 minutes, I am going to take you back to the, to the main, to the class, right? So that we can share the information. Okay, so uh, I think that we are ready to go. Um, yeah, perfect. We go in one, two, and three. Please accept the invitation to join the breakout room.
Okay, accept the invitation to join the breakout room. Uh, Gustavo? Yes, I accepted, but returning to the, to the main. Really? Room. Okay, let me try it one more time. Now? Gustavo, do you get it? Okay, perfect. Yanari, can you hear me? I have the invitation, teacher. Okay, I'm going to send yes, you the teacher. invitation one more time. Okay, teacher. Did you get it? Quaternary ammonium in gallons. Yes. Yeah, but the, the bottle will be a little bottle. If you, yeah, it could be. Oh, we can have a different presentation for that. For me, I think normally in a, everybody buy four gallons. Yeah. Chemicals or something like that. Teacher, how do you say if we want to? We want to say say that we reproduce the plants, he healthy plants. Healthy plants. Mm -hmm. What do you mean by healthy plants? Mm -hmm. Spanish is too much, too hard. Uh, In Spanish, saluda plantas saludables, plantas uh -huh. bonitas. Eh, no con tanto químico. Organic. 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 Para for you. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, so we can say that that we produce a. Wow, that looks beautiful. I don't hear about that GPS. BTS, what? No, is that? For a pet? Is this one? Um, wanna share the share this, and let me show you. Is this apple tag? Oh, they, okay. They used to put put this in the. If the. <laughs> In the Laura, <laughs> it's actually like like you were saying, Jacqueline. In like it's like in the U.S. There's a it's not an app. It's like you were saying. There's a chip. Yes, in, it's a in, tracking chip. In the so U.S. If, you, and if your dog Europe. or cat gets lost, you could track it where it where it's located at. Depends. So that one's kind of different. It's, Yes, oh. this is kind of different. Because here in the country are no cheap for the pet, right? I don't know. I don't know how it works in other countries. But I think maybe with without this, just the app to help organize the pet information. Okay. To not complicate mm -hmm. that lot. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. For me, well, I agree with you. I don't know, uh, with Freddy and Laura. Laura, can you tell us something? Maybe it's not here right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, just I'm just 
<laughs> sleep my baby. <laughs> so ah, <I> sorry. <laughs> because I come into my home and my baby is now crying for want to sleep. For but attention. I listen <laughs> because I'm sorry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Thank you. So if you were gonna work on on that, what what that app, we we'll have to start. Yes, we have to start right. thinking in strengths. Yeah, the first one will be the strength. We keep it short. Course. We will keep it short. So we have the idea. Exactly. No. We For you, to... that since since you you brought the idea of that, what's the strain of that? The the strength the strength the strength the strength 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 strength. You have to you have to uh, put the theta <laughs> sound at the end. Strength 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 strength. 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 I didn't see an app like this before to this to this day. Maybe that so can be a one of a kind. <laughs> one of a kind, right? But what, what, that can be what a, can you offer of the app or it could be like the strength for like people won't won't try to to get another app or to use something original. else. What makes exactly. it what makes it original? What makes it that the best. The best. Exactly. First, uh, what I see is that the, there is no other app that I have seen before that can do this so, right now. So, but maybe this is an opportunity more than a, a strength. Strength. That's exactly. one thing you, you need to you, uh -huh, you need to distinguish right when it's a strength yes. and when it's an opportunity when it's a weakness and when it's a threat. That's exactly. right. I think not having another app like this is an opportunity for an opportunity. this idea. Yes. So one of a kind. One of a kind. One of a kind. Yeah. Um, how did this write that? One of, of a kind. A kind. Okay. With D. Exactly. One of a kind. Um, uh, strength. Strength. Can be, if we make the, the Okay. Well, the new product is quaternary ammonium with essence, lemon and lavender. Lavender. Yes. In, in three percent. Lavender. 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 Uh -huh. Lavender. Lavender. Okay. In three presentations. Two ounces. Yes. Two ounces. Uh, yes. A liter and a gallon. Yes. Okay. Okay. This is this is our new product. Very yes. nice. Okay. Uh, what is the strange is teacher? How do you pronounce strength? Strength. Strength with the strength. with the theta sound at the end. Strength. 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 Uh huh. Okay. What is our strength? Strengths. Mm -hmm. A new, new, new. How do you say aromas? Essent. Essent. Essencia son scent. You can say aroma, but in this case, yeah, it's usually scents. Uh, scents. Okay. New scents. Uh, mm -hmm. What, what else? Okay, I think Jennifer is coming to your group so you can catch her up. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay, no problem. Okay, once she enters. Who will uh, who will write the presentation? Me. Okay. 
<laughs> Hello, <laughs> partners. <laughs> Why not? Why not? <laughs> Hello, Jennifer. Hey. Um, de, de, delicate, 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 delicate. They are not so delicate. Yes, no, what are you talking yes. about? Yes, cactus and succulents. Okay. Mm -hmm. Teacher is strength. 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 With the third sound at the end. Strength. 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 So that they are not so delicate for me is a strength. Okay. I'm going to, 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 to repeat. Okay. Strengths are we can reproduce for yourself. Uh, succulents and cactus are organic plants. And we don't need to take care a lot because they aren't so delicate. Mm -hmm. Okay. Opportunity. I just had one. Low competition of the market. On the market. On the market. Mm -hmm. Do you have another one? Or only or only that? For the moment, only that. Okay. I have it. Witnesses. We don't have reputation yet about the business. Yeah. And treat. The weather is changeable. Right. Threat. Threat, threat. threat. The weather threat. is changeable. <laughs> okay, so in the opportunities, maybe we can use um, customer loyalty. Because in that business, when a person buy, for example, one plant, then they keep buying plants. Okay. So the, the customer loyalty could be. In this uh, kind of business, we can sell the plants and we teach our customers to reproduce by themselves. Yes, maybe not to reproduce, but how they can take care of the plants. Because if, if they reproduce or business, Quick, 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 quick. Go out. Ah, okay. oh, we'll go down. Yeah. <laughs> we go okay. out. Mm -hmm. And a difficult. Uh, so we just change witness to threat. So Resource limitation, there. competition do better than you. Since your company lacks something, this app can lack maybe. Include an each selling proposition. A threat can be that is very easy to copycat, to copy, to to imitate. To imitate. imitate. Okay, not a lot of people are interested, interested with ED. In, ah, okay, okay. Interested in managing. Managing. Their pets or the behavior of their pets. What is the, the management? It's not like a behavior, it's more like a keep the pet information uh, in uh, space. Just yeah. manage uh, your pet information. Like mm -hmm. when it uh, when need to be vaccinating, when is its birthday. Oh, okay, okay. 
Got what it. things they like, uh, something it's like a, it's, it's more um, like an info app. It's more like an info app. A reminder, it reminds you everything. Right. Just something like that. Actually, it just remind me a video. Uh, it just remind me a video that Visito Comunica make about uh, an Apple Watch. It reminds him everything. It's like, have you, have you eaten today? <laughs> have you drank yeah, like, of water today? <laughs> yeah, something like that that can help the people just control and be more um, near the, their pets. It's easy to to make <laughs> weakness, weakness, weaknesses. Let's see, uh, I think it's very easy to imitate. It's a threat or a weakness, like something like the competition can do better than you. And another app, if it's easy to imitate, it's easy to, to, to make better. Hmm. Kind of confusing that one. Yes, I'm confused too. Two competitors do better than you. Any idea, Laura or Jackie? <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking on that, but it it's difficult because well, uh, opportunities are no, sorry, weaknesses are similar than the threats. Well, it's very significant. Okay, checking that strength. But, um, puede ver, bueno, lo voy a decir en español. Going to tell you in Spanish. In weakness, uh, people might want to download any other app to remind them. Yes, will be. Can be another one or I don't I don't know I I'm try to I'm trying but I can't Another type of app that remind remind the dates maybe. The, the the price for the product will will be uh, in, increase, yeah. Yes. Yeah, and um, it could be this this amount will be a problem for for our company but i don't know because it could be a little peak or a higher amount i don't know but it could be a uh, uh weaknesses yes yeah, i, I this think could that... be but remember the, the the things that are good always are expensive yeah yeah uh, 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 is normally because it's a, a different form formulation. Okay, teacher, we need more time. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm, I'm, check, I'm checking all. I'm checking all the groups. Nobody has finished. So go ahead. Okay. okay. Thank you. Fast and furious mode. 
Yeah. Then it is Nitra. Okay. We are pioneers in the industry of GPS by satellite signal, I think. Signal. Signal. Yeah. Okay. We are pioneers. Oh, with the, oh, with the, maybe you can to track or tracking the, the your, you are pioneers the the the, 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 the moment or your pet okay yes mm -hmm. okay. okay how is the name of the company oh, so or the product yes. um, ah, so you're almost done that's why you're thinking about the name Yes, teacher. Yeah. <laughs> we are slash. I think, yeah, I think that you are the ones that are a little bit more advanced right now. Um, the name could be maybe to, to take care of the dogs, like um, medicines or um, cosmetics. Shampoos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like the vet can, yes, it can work in a related way. I don't know how to say it more spe specifically. In a specific word. Yes, like have a, like an Uber, right? The, the vet can download a, a, a section of the app la, that help um write some information of the pet in the interface and with the same ID of the pet that information uh, travel to the owners of the pet and they receive the, the that information auto automatic automatically 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 automatic Automatically. 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 There you go. Automatically. Automatically. What about opportunities? Opportunities. Hey. So you're almost done, right? Almost. <laughs> Almost. Almost. But we have problems with the weaknesses and opportunities. <laughs> well, opportunities probably to grow, right? Uh, you can think about that. In the, like looking to the future, what opportunities do you have? Like expanding In expand the app around the world. Another. Maybe that with another functions like like maybe work with a track device, but later. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, innovation is important. One more minute. One more. <laughs> um, the, the question of the million dollars who is going to to explain to, to share. the uh -huh, in explain. the <laughs> in the main room. <laughs> Maybe with this, <laughs> with one more witness. Mm. I already ran out of ideas. Don't worry if you're running out of ideas because uh, I will ask the rest of the groups to or the teams to probably give an opinion about what else can be an, uh, an opportunity or what else could be a strength based on your explanation. Oh, okay, so we're done. <laughs> yeah, <really. laughs> That's great. Okay, I think we're ready to go back. Okay. <laughs> That's a good idea, teacher. <laughs> Oh. 
All right. So uh, the rest are, are going to take every second left so they can finish. I think only one group was completely done. And um, the other ones were kind of like, like your group. Um, Fabio, they were missing just a couple of uh, strength or weaknesses. And every product was different, so that's pretty cool. Okay, they're coming back. Yep, we didn't finish. <laughs> we need more time. I gave you more than 15 minutes if you if you see the time right now. Uh, however, um, however, don't worry. Uh, I was telling the last group that I was um, talking to that at the end of the presentation from each group, we are going to give a space for the rest of the teams or the team members or the teams uh, from other uh, ideas uh, to give their opinion, right? Like, for example, you finish your presentation and you say, that, okay, we didn't find a lot of opportunities with this product. And maybe somebody from another team can tell you, well, an opportunity can be to create an app so that people can check their, their pets through the app and uh, install a camera at home. So we can get ideas from each other because in the end, it's not an evaluation. What we're doing right now is just sharing, experiencing and practicing, right? How to make a SWOT analysis. We're not experts, okay? First of all, we are learning on the process and um, that's part of learning, right? to hesitate, to doubt, to make mistakes, to, um, to get blocked, like no ideas, it's normal. However, uh, it's all about perspective because for example, uh, I'm the kind of person who sees uh, threats or weaknesses as opportunities to improve. So I usually see the ne see the positive in the negative. So uh, and we were talking about that when we were uh, writing the threats. Uh huh. Exactly. So in the end, it's not exactly like okay, everything is negative. No, I mean something negative can become into something positive because, for example, if a weakness that you have in your product is that a lot of people are not interested in taking care of their pets, for example, in El Salvador, uh, because they don't want to spend money or because they don't have time or they uh, are not into pets. So you can see that as an opportunity to, uh, for example, uh, what do people like nowadays? Um, okay, people like uh, cell phones. Okay, so an opportunity can be to create an app like a game where kids, teenagers, adults can play and at the same time they can learn uh, about how to take care of an animal. And from there, from the game and the propaganda, I mean, not the pro propaganda, but from the advertisements and all these uh, things that you're going to create on social networks, like a campaign, right? For example, adopt a dog and um, we will give you, I don't know, um, a a sack of food for two months um, sponsored by pedigree. Okay, So uh, from there, people might get interested, right? Because kids want to have a dog or a cat. And now the parents are like, okay, so they want a dog. I'm going to get a dog, right? So um, it can be seen as an opportunity. Now, Let's go on. Uh, who's the first volunteer? Who would like to start? Or we go according to the order in the break of rooms. What do you say about that? Do we have a volunteer or we, the of the we follow the order? Okay. So usually, usually the first one in the in the list is the first one to, to pass, right? <laughs> but we're going to do it the other way around. We're going to go from the last one to the first one. Okay. So in this case, the last group was the group number four. Uh, Freddy's, Jackie, Laura, and Fabio. Okay, so you will have 
uh, four minutes to talk about your product. Remember that you are just going to explain it. You don't have to say everything literally the way that you wrote it, right? But try to go straight to the point and tell us a little bit uh, about your product before you make the analysis. Okay, what is the product about? And, and probably why is that relevant, right? Okay, so, or why is that innovative? Who's a volunteer to present from your group? It's Roberto, Roberto's idea. <laughs> okay, so Fabio, your turn. Okay, uh, we think as a group uh, in creating in creating a app to help uh, organize the owners, uh, organize the, their pet information, like uh, having a better control in their in their bed in their beds day mm -hmm. uh, when it, when the pets uh, have their birthday, what allergies they have, uh, what is their favorite favorite food, something like that. We, in addition having the the app working with the veterinar veterinarian's help like um, like kind of uber they have uh, the drivers and the passengers something like that uh, like the the section of owners and the section for for better bets for bed for the bets uh -huh. for the bets like uh -huh, something like that uh, we try to um, find uh, no. Try to see what uh, what are these idea strengths, mm -hmm. weakness, opportunities, and threats. Mm -hmm. And we fi we find that is an um, well, we say that it's an app that you can use everywhere because an app in the phone is very useful. Mm -hmm. It's accessible. Uh, mm -hmm. Accessible, right? Um, it needs to be available in iOS and Play Store with an intuitive interface for owners and vets. And that the vets can work in a related way with this app. Okay. Um, for the witness, we we still have very short. We can just think, and uh, people can download download another tab that another app that can do something similar. Maybe not the same things, but like remember that help them the help them even remember some dates, and that can be similar to the app in the in some way. Mm -hmm. So maybe they say, I don't need the birthday. I don't need their food, I just need when they have their bed control and mm -hmm. something, That's nothing it. more. So as opportunity, we at least don't see an app like this before. So mm -hmm. we say it's a one of a kind. We need to be, we need to make a better study to, <laughs> to, make, to see if this is, is right or not. But uh -huh. for now, I see as opportunity. And the app, as the way it is, can be expand to be more bigger, to have a lot of functions. To be bigger. Like, mm -hmm. To be bigger, like having some uh, cameras addition, or having some identification of the pet via chip or another type of GPS. <laughs> GPS, right? Uh -huh. Having some way that maybe in the future can work. <laughs> yeah. Uh, as a threat, as the way it is now in, in as an idea, it's very easy to imitate. Anybody can see just the simple, the simple parts of the app and can say, ah, I can do it. Something similar, maybe better, maybe worse, but can be very very easy to imitate, mm -hmm. and we put uh, that here in the Salvador are no there are not so many people interested in in managing their pets, but 
as you say, this can also be an opportunity like, ah, we see here, maybe there are not many people interested, but we can make something that they can be, we can change that. Mm -hmm. So I put it in yellow. <laughs> okay, <laughs> excellent. Want... Time is up. Excellent, very good. The reactions, class for the group, num well, the team number four. Thank you so much. Do you have a name for the app? No. No. <laughs> okay, so it's, it's, it's still in process. It's, a, it's still a, in process. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's just a business idea right now. Excellent. Thank you so much, guys. We continue with the team number three. Uh, do you have any comment or suggestion for this, for this team? Anyone? It's my team, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, team number three. No, uh, it's Floor, Beatriz, Elizabeth, and Gustavo. Yes. Okay. Uh, I got to, pre to present this. this um, um, this business, okay, so go ahead. we can try to, to explain uh, completely. Uh, okay, the, the name of the company is Sunshine because uh, uh, we, we sell plants like uh, cactus and succulent. So okay. uh, our, how's the name of the, of the logo? Uh, it is never stop to grow, to grow up. The, for this this business, we 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 try to, to sell this kind of, of plants uh, with different uh, species. The, in the strains, we have uh, this 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 plant um, produce the plants by ourselves or, or themselves. Uh, this kind of plants is uh, organic plants. Um, also, these plants uh, don't need taking care a lot. Um, for the opportunities for in, in, the, in this uh, business, uh, we don't sell just plants. We sell happiness. We sell the experience. We sell memories. Uh, also, we have a uh, low competition of the market, and we create a customer loyalty for for this kind of experience. Uh, also, uh, we sell uh, another supplement for for these plants like fertilizer, pomme stone, uh, pot, like, like that. In the witnesses, we have um, we don't have reputation yet about the business, and another uh, witnesses that we we find is the um, sometimes the the photo or the image the, the image of this kind of, of plants can be uh, different of the real plants. I don't know if, if you understand the point. Yeah, we have the photo, but sometimes the, the plants uh, grow up different. So it is this kind of thing we don't, we can't uh, have the control about that. Yeah, this is the, the weakness. And the treats, uh, we have the, the weather is changeable in the pest for this plant. But, uh, uh, this is our company. Uh, if I don't know if someone else wants to uh, agree or improve something else. Or want to buy a plant. <laughs> That's it, teacher. That's it. This is the end. This is our company. We're proud about this.
Uh, teacher, you have turned off your microphone. Okay, sorry, I thought that it was on. So they already have the logo and the slogan never stop growing. So awesome. Any comments or questions for the team number three? With the succulents and cactus? Any ideas? One, one strength. One strength, uh-huh. Yes, it's a, a perfect present for any special date. Oh, okay, okay. So it can Entonces, be it can be multi-purpose, right? Puerto for Rico presents. Yes, teacher, we don't sell just plan. We sell memories, y happiness, y and things like that. Okay, excellent. Entonces, class for them, eh, very good. You don't forget to use the reactions for your classmates. Okay, awesome. So we have two teams. Taras for you, and we go on with the team number two. So team number two was uh, composed by Blanca, Diana, Francisco, and Miguel. There you have it. Okay. Um, we didn't finish, but. <laughs> we but we tried. Uh -huh. Yeah, you were close. I don't know if Blanca can help to present this. Okay, Diana, you too. Okay, the name of our product is Finding Your Pet. It's uh, a new technology that we want to implement to find your lost pet. And this, we, we classify, classify. We classify. We classify, okay, the strengths, weakness, opportunities, and threats. The strengths, well, we are the first company introduced the product in El Salvador, especially for pets. Uh, our products work with satellite, 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 satellite. satellite signal. Mm -hmm. That means that you don't have to use uh, Bluetooth or Wi-Fi to connect with your pet. And that's, it's helpful because when your pet is far from you, you can find wherever they are. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's waterproof, resistant to bites and falls. It's resistant yeah. to falls, yeah. Uh, have a low, a low cost. And you can mo you can monitor the health of your pet with the with the dispositive device okay. with the device device with the device yeah yeah okay Diana you can share about the witness yes oh we only brought two. The battery only lasts a week. And if we forgot to charge the battery, we lost our pet. <laughs> um, and wireless stocks last because we only have a few, uh, a few, how to say this? I Reduce quantity? Yes. And the opportunities, our target market is big because many, and nowadays many people have pets, especially dogs, cats. And there are a lot of campaigns about take, take, taking care of the pets and many foundations too. So um, we, we made a, a, a study <laughs> uh, for to launch this product <laughs> and, <laughs> and also we are a pioneers in the sat satellite signal signal You're pioneers in the satellite signal okay signal. yeah in this product kind of product and we can implement this technology for people with special disease like special... Um, that in the future that in the future. Mm -hmm. 
special disease. Um, yeah, we, we, we're talking about people that have Alzheimer, for example, uh, that okay, okay. you can use that technology to find the, the people that lost because of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people with but special it, conditions. Okay. Yeah, um, but it's in the future when we can implement too, more, too much device. <laughs> um, Blanca, can you continue with the threats? We didn't okay. finish the last one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have Sorry. two threads. Uh -huh. uh, one of the threads that it can be that another company can implement, say, technology to improve. And we think about the threads. It's a, it's a, an opportunity too because we can. We can make a, I don't know how to say that, but um, a marca registrada, how to say that? Freight brand. Freight brand? Freight brand, yeah. Yeah, we can. Uh... Oh, the time is up. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Sorry. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, so thank you so much for sharing. Class for them, please. Reactions for them. That was really, really interesting. Innovative. <laughs> okay, innovative. Uh, and the last but not the least group or team in this case is uh, team number one. We had Mariela, Harbin, Jennifer, who joined us already, and Rolando. I think Janari uh, um, was there at the end. So Tell us, guys. You were thinking about the pandemic for your product, right? So go ahead. Okay. I will share something. Okay. The Hello, everybody. The name of our company is Brocky Lab. And the new the new product is um, quaternary ammonium with essence lemon and lavender. You know what is um, uh, quaternary ammonium? Yeah, it's uh, for sanitas sanitizing. Yeah, for yeah. sanitizing. That's right. Okay, very nice. For uh, our strengths, for for our new product is that product using fragrances or essence, mm -hmm. and is using for different ways in different places. Yeah, and we have a different size, three different sizes: uh, two ounces, one liter, and one gallon. Yeah, normally the um, the quaternary ammonium is without essence, and mm. the innovation for our product is the essence. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The opportunities. Um, normally, the customer uh, like try new products. Yeah, and the essence is a click for our products. Yeah. Um, and we have two products in one because we can clean and disinfect them in the same time. Yeah. Disinfect. Uh, yeah. Got it. Okay. Understand? Okay. Very nice. The weaknesses of uh, for our product is uh, quaternary ammonium is a popular product. Yeah. You can buy for any place, mm -hmm. yeah, for anywhere. But, um, but we will try with, with this product. And uh, we change the, the, the formulation and we, inc we increase the price for our product. Uh, it could be a witness. Oh. And, yeah, it could be. Uh, but, the chains have uh, 
have a, a this kind of of witnesses. Yeah, yeah, true. For all kind of products. Yeah. And the traits, uh, threats. threats is that the people don't like the essence. Yeah, and prefer the normal uh, uh, presentation. Yeah. Uh -huh. Actually, yeah, it can be a threat. It can be a threat. Okay. Yeah, yeah, and you can see the price, uh, and you can buy. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Okay, there you go. Class for them, please. The team number one. Awesome. I'm going to use a thumbs up. Where are they? Okay, here. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much, uh, Rolando, for representing your team. And well, now I would like to hear some comments about this activity. Uh, how do you like it? It's nice. It was nice. Why? Because, because, because um, we can, uh, no, we did uh, using our mind and invent yeah, many things. Uh, 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 this, this activity uh, get the opportunity to discuss with another. Yeah, and, and I think that what's nice. Okay, so now you're becoming experts in making a SWOT analysis, right? Uh, <laughs> Fredis, you want to say something? Thank you, Rolando. Yeah, like I was saying, it's the same as, as what he was saying right now. It makes you think a lot. It makes you think a lot. Okay. Yeah, thinking is good. <laughs> That's what I like to ask the, ask the question, why? When people tell me something, right? When my students tell me something. It was nice. Why? Uh, because reasons? Just because? <laughs> now you have to give a reason, right? An explanation. Okay, anybody else? Maybe a lady wants to speak? Beatriz? Well, uh, I like these kinds of activities uh, because you had the opportunity to talk a lot. Of. So if you don't talk with this kind of activity, you lost the opportunity to practice and improve your English. Exactly, right? So you have to take advantage of the opportunities, right? That you have to practice because in the end, this is not my class, this is your class, okay? I am not the one that has to practice because I already practice a lot during my teaching life, right? Uh, actually, it's like, let's see, in October, that would be like 13, month, 13 years um, teaching. Teaching right? in English. So it's, it's been a while, right? So I am not the one that has to practice, okay? It's you. Um, and uh, what matters is that you do it. It doesn't matter if you make mistakes because that's part of the process, okay? Uh, when I was a student, I used to make a lot of mistakes, but those mistakes helped me to improve and to learn. So um, that's what I'm here now, right? Imagine if I didn't make mistakes, if I didn't learn, I wouldn't be a good teacher. I think that I would make a lot of mistakes and I would be teaching something that is not right. <laughs> Okay, I will be telling you, okay, so the pronunciation of this word is strange, and it's not strange, right, it's a strength, um, and then I will tell you, okay, so the arbor class, uh, you can reduce, uh, and you, you add the comma at the end of the sentence, no, right, so you need to learn, okay, but you do it little by little. Now, uh, due to time, okay, we're going to stop here with the review. So that was the purpose of today's class that we can that we could finish with the with the topic of the unit one that was not only focused on the grammar and vocabulary but also on the content. Okay, that was mainly the SWOT analysis. That now that you did it, now that you're experts, you know that it's it can be something important, right? For a product, but also for a person, because in this case we we'll focus on the product, but you can do a SWOT, you can make a SWOT analysis for yourself, okay? 
Um, so individually, as a, as a professional, what are your strengths? What are your weaknesses? What are, what are your opportunities to improve or to grow? What are your threats, right? So um, you, could do, you can do that. It actually would be a really good exercise that will help you to reflect and analyze yourself, right, as, as a worker. So um, that will be all for today. Do you have any questions or comments before we uh, finish the class? Uh, today, uh, let me check. For some reason, I do not see, oh, I see Blanca there. So Blanca, uh, you told me that you could stay tonight, right? Well, I stayed on Monday, but... Okay, it was you on Monday? Wait yeah. a second, let me check the list. So who was because the person that couldn't stay yesterday? I think on was, Monday. I think it was Floor, but Floor... Yesterday was, was Floor. Driving. Uh -huh. So I'm not sure if she's gonna be able to stay. Okay, so we have a problem, Houston. Um. So after Floor, well, after Freddy's was uh, Janari. I'm not sure if Janari can stay. If not, that would be Beatriz. So Janari, could you? Could you, could you? Uh, teacher, and Are you having I, I can't. Yes, teacher, I have uh, problems. Yeah, you have been having those issues. Uh, Beatriz? Yes. Yes, okay, perfect. Thank you so much. So guys, this is the end of the of, of the week one in the module. That means that by today, you need to be done with the assignments of the first uh, unit, okay? So, um, and then next week, we are going to be working with the, I mean, from tomorrow until next week, we're going to be working with the unit two. Remember that every, every unit is developed in approximately uh, one week, okay? Um, the date, don't forget about the date, okay? For the midterm, I'm going to be reminding you anyways. Uh, but for today, everything was great. Thank you so much and congratulations for doing such a great job, such an amazing job with your, with your team. Uh, making analysis, a SWOT analysis is not an easy, an easy thing. And I know that it's not your expertise, right? That you're not working on, the, on this kind of area. However, uh, as I don't know who said that, but it was an intelligent person, um, the, that we should never stop learning, okay? And the day that you say, I know enough, you will be dead, all right? Uh, so as long as we have life, we need to learn as much as we can, no matter what the topic is, okay? We need to be open to, le to learning new things. So it's good for our brain. So we are uh, avoiding to get, I don't know, Alzheimer or any other mental illness in the future. So <laughs> we need to stay active, right? Mentally active, because sometimes we are physically active, but not too much mentally, right? So this can help us a lot, learning a language, uh, discussing, learn, reading. I mean, um, that that is really good for our brain. So thank you so much. Have a good night. Uh, bon appetit if you're going to have dinner. <laughs> and don't forget that we continue with the classes tomorrow. Okay, we start the unit two. So you can take a look at the manual, what we're going to be studying tomorrow. Uh, you can antic anticipate a little bit. And... Um, that will be all. If there are no questions, everything is clear. So one more time, congratulations for today's performance. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Good night, okay, classmates. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. Good night, everybody. Bye. 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 Good night. See you oh. tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow we're taking the picture. We didn't take it today. So okay. we're going to do that bye -bye. tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Okay, so we're just waiting for Jackie and Brenda to disconnect. Okay, so we're ready.
Yeah. Nice, nice background. Where is that place? I have no idea. It looks like an Earth planet. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know my my kid uh, do that. Ah, oh, okay. The background. So they they. I mean, he uses uh, Zoom as well. Yeah. Mm, okay. You got just but, one child? No, I had two, two. but my my younger kid to the background. Ah, okay, okay. She's only 10 years old. Oh, it's a girl. N he is only He's 10, 10 years okay. old. Okay. Yes. And the other one? 12 years old. 12. It's my daughter. Yes. Your daughter. Okay. So nice. So how are you, how is it going? How have you been, Beatriz? Well, I have been very well. My daughter is good about her she health. She was sick, right? Uh huh. Yeah, she was. She was sick. She was uh, operated by emergency by appendicitis. Oh. Yeah. She she she's uh, twelve years old, mm -hmm. and by she we can we can do that because she has a, a strong pain. And, and, and that it was the only solution for for eliminate that pain. Yeah, actually, you have to do it quickly because it can get worse if you don't go to the doctor as soon as possible. Yeah, we start. Uh, we visit the hospital San Rafael in Santa Tecla at about four four p.m. But she was operated until. 12 until midnight but wow. now she uh, is very she's very nice she's well okay yeah i'm glad to know that thank you okay teacher. so um it's good that you're back right in the classes and everything i don't know if you have any any comments or any doubt uh, regarding the module regarding the unit or the language in general uh I, I feel happy with this course uh, because I I tell you I told you uh, five five years no no two weeks ago when we finished the last course uh -huh. I feel I learn more in this course. Uh, more than two or three courses that I took before, that I attend before, mm -hmm. uh, because the way that you use is different than like other teachers that I had. So I had the opportunity to speak a lot, and I speak a lot. I speak a lot, mm -hmm. and I feel I I improved my fluency. I'm going to tell you something. Uh, at the beginning, I tried to think and to coordinate the the words to speak, but now is I feel is easier than three lessons uh, before because sometimes I don't I don't think I speak more fluently. More spontaneously. Yes, more spontaneously. Uh, I I'm going to ask you something. Okay. Sometimes I forget some some grammatical structures. For example, if you are talking for a specific uh, topic, and I agree with you, or I do not agree with you, I forget what is the correct way to give you the answer. Uh, the problem is neither do I, can do I, so do I, I forget uh -huh. how, how to do that. How, how to, to do that. Yeah, how to give you the correct answer if I okay. agree with your topic or I'm not agreed or I'm I disagree with you. I disagree, I disagree. Okay, so in that case, uh, 
when you are, it depends on the tense, the grammar tense that I am using. Uh, so you are going to use that auxiliary verb that corresponds to, to that specific um, tense. For instance, if I say- uh, The problem I, specific is if I tell you and disagree. I know sometimes I can use can or, or do, yeah, or that's, according that's what, the, the auxiliary. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what right. I was telling you. I was telling you that, for example, if I tell you, I don't like chocolate and you are like, I don't like chocolate either. So you can say, uh, neither do I, neither do I, because I am, I am using the, the face, the simple present, right? So I'm using a, a verb, any verb, except the verb to be, because if I use the verb to be, you are going to use the verb to be. Uh, but if, if it is any other verb, we use do, right, for the for the simple present. So if I say uh, I play soccer every day, uh, you can say me too, right? But uh, uh, so do I. So do I. If I tell you uh, I cook well, so so do I. Um, so if I tell you I am uh, 33 years old and you are like, so am I. So you, you are the same age as me. So, so am I, because I told you I am, right? So am I. Uh, but if I use a model verb, for example, can or could or should or will or any model or auxiliary verb or model auxiliary verb, you are going to use the same one in your answer. So for example, if I say, I will go to the party, so will I. So it's just the so, the verb that I am using, the, the model verb or the auxiliary verb, and I. For example, uh, if I say, um, I should take a shower uh, every day, and then you are like, so should I. Um, and the other thing is that uh, that would be for the affirmative, right? But yeah. if it is negative and you agree with me in the negative, you say you use neither. So you don't okay. say so, you use neither. Neither do I. Neither am neither, I. Neither, neither am I. I. Neither can I. Neither should I. Uh huh. So for example, if I say, I shouldn't speak Spanish in class, neither should I, neither should I. So um, it's the same rule, but you only change the, the word, right? Instead of so, we use neither. Neither, uh, okay. And for the affirmative, uh, well, for the negative, you can also use another structure. For example, if I say, I don't uh, have a lot of free time. Uh, I don't have a lot of free time. You can say, neither do I, or I don't either. I don't either. So I'm telling you this just in case, right? You have the opportunity to hear that, that somebody tells you, ah, I don't either. And you are like, what's that? It's the same thing, okay? Uh, neither do okay. I. Neither do I is more informal, but if you say uh, I don't either, it's more formal, okay? Um, I don't either. Or uh, I can't play the piano. I can't either. I can't either. So we use the model in the negative and either at the end. I can say neither can I. You can say neither can I, uh -huh. it's the other option or I can't either. Those answers are only for sentences. Are there questions? Mm, no, no, use for sentences, for uh, affirmations, for negative and affirmative sentences or statements. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and I have a, another question. I don't know if we have enough time to ask. Tell me. 
Okay, for adverb clause. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I have a little confused. Confusion, uh, what? A little confusion, yes. Uh, because I identify, I make some mistakes with the verb that I had to use. Yes, that I went did the exercise. Uh -huh. uh, I used the verb for the second sentences, not the first one. Ah. So you change the verb where the preposition of time is. Yes. Uh huh. So that is the verb that you're going to change, the one that goes after the preposition of time. Okay, and that's my problem. Sometimes I don't know what verb I had to I had to change. Mm -hmm. If if the the first sentence or the second one. It depends because you can use the adverb phrase at the beginning or at the end, right? If, okay. the, if the adverb phrase is at the beginning, then you change the verb at the beginning. But if the adverb okay. phrase is at the end, you change the verb that is at the end. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. That That's the only questions and the okay. only doubts that I, that I had, teacher. No problem. Those are good doubts. I like it. Thank so you. thank you for staying and thank you for uh, clarifying those doubts with me. Thank you, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. Have a good night, Beatriz. Good night, teacher. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.